Hello everybody, thanks a lot for checking back. This is Dave from Free Run Speed. Saucony Kinvara fans, the Kinvara 14 is about to come out to a store near you. There's a whole bunch new with this Kinvara 14. And let's start with the midsole. There's three millimeters more stack height in the Convara 14 from the Convara 13. That just means there's three millimeters more under your foot to cushion your foot. Added to that is their new Power Run Comfort sock liner, which is seven millimeters thick. So that gives you an additional two millimeters under your foot. So it's actually five millimeters difference between 14 and 13. They've also raised the sidewalls so that when you get up and go, when you're on, when you're out there running and you get up to speed, your foot is secure on the platform. When you go around corners, your foot is secure on the platform, keeps your foot centered Make sure you hit the sweet spot of the forefoot. The outsole, I apologize that it's very dirty. Um, it's got this kind of herringbone design to it. It's going to give you more traction. It's also, the Convar has always been exceptionally durable. Even though it's all exposed foam, except for a couple spots. And this is just going to add, it's just going to make continue down that path of of making this shoe very durable. One functional piece of design that is different from Convara's of the past is right here under the arch. The Convara always had a, it wasn't a post of any kind, but it was a, an element of support. If you look at your Convara, you will notice right here under your arch, there's an element of support. And that really had a functional purpose. The Convara was always fairly supportive for the type of shoe that it was. The change, and I think this shoe will actually feel even slightly more supportive on your foot, is the raised sidewalls. Now, they don't need to put this on the midsole because they've raised the sidewalls, keeping your foot centered on the platform. The upper, the best thing I can say is the, the 13 and the 12 had stuff on the upper. That stuff has been removed. And it's a simple, real open mesh upper with the gusseted tongue, a little bit of padding in the tongue, but simply this shoe is lightweight and fast. That's what the Convara always felt like. And this upper matches that feel. My only complaint to Saucony, and part of it is my foot, because I will firmly admit that I have a skinny foot, these laces are ridiculously long. Even double tying them, the loops were hitting the ground. Anyway, if there's anything to complain about, if it's the laces, it's not really a complaint. Convara fans, you know why you buy the shoe. You know that it's delivered for you. It will deliver for you with a little bit more foam under your foot. So it's light, it's, it feels fast, it feels like your Kinvara, smooth, quiet, everything that you've come to love about it. And as you know, it's fairly inexpensive in today's world of running shoes. As I said, it's inexpensive, $120. Seven ounces on the men's size nine, 6.2 ounces on the women's size eight. If you're a Convara fan, you know who you are. You're gonna be able to seamlessly go into this shoe 
and running it. You, some of you will have complaints. It always happens. But your complaints will be minimal compared to the feel of the shoe and why you got into the Kinvar in the first place. You're going to like this version. Thanks a lot for watching. Talk to you next time.